New at 6, voters in Johnson Creek have decided to build a new kind of school. And as Todd Hicks reports, the district has been pushing for a dome school for years. After five attempts over the last nine years, Johnson Creek will get a new combined high school and middle school. It'll take the place of this outdated facility. It's finally here. <laughs> Jeff Constable is overwhelmed. A new dome school for his children will be built on the site of this cornfield in Johnson Creek. Voters approved the $18.9 million plan Tuesday. There was so much energy put into this uh, in the past, so many referendums with, that have failed. It's, uh, it's very exciting. It was the fifth time residents voted on a different version of this plan. In the past, some said it was just too expensive. I understand their need, but they got to find a cheaper way to do it. The plan approved Tuesday won't include an athletic field. The superintendent tells me they'll look for another way to pay for it. We think through philanthropy and, and other fundraising we can do those projects outside of the referendum. The school will be energy efficient and will vastly improve school security, something Constable says is vital. What's going on in the world these days, you want to be secure, you want your kids to have the safest place to learn. And the superintendent tells me they hope to have that school up and running in the fall of 2015. In Johnson Creek, Todd Hicks, today's TMJ4.